I am Kamuske Kamara from Sierra Leone, West Africa. Well, I believe um, I am a change maker because looking at the, the, the surrounding my environment and my community that I was born and looking at what I've done and what I've been doing and what I still try to do to change the lives of young people and children, um, in that context, I believe I'm a change maker. Growing up in Sierra Leone, Freetown, I noticed that young people and children are into drug abuse and also there's lack of attention for children. And then my community actually was going down. So I decided to actually establish a campaign that is called This Is Not Me. This Not Me is an initiative from a friend that is a victim of drug. We decided to go to the different communities and schools to talk to them, to create an awareness of dangers within drug and how they can come out of drug because we found out that drug is kind of busy that if only you're willing to accept then you become free being part of a marginalized group in my community there's this stereotype that says we are not going to make a change we are not going to be better so i want to prove that we are going to make a change and we are going to be better i want to actually change the lives of young people because i believe we are the future of today and not tomorrow because our tomorrow starts today. I wanted to actually see that my people, young people around us, have that kind of mentality that would enable them to secure a better future and better lives for themselves and the community. So it was very important to me because it's a stereotype in my community that you can never make a change. And I want to break that, that kind of the initiative that yes, indeed, we can make a change. Taking up such a um, task in my community was kind of impossible. I faced um, a lot of difficulties and challenges among, first of all, my friends that actually shared the initiative too, willingness to join because I couldn't do it alone. I need support, not financial support, but actually, I need um, their physical support to actually contribute immensely. I also faced um, difficulties when we try to go to different communities and schools to actually preach out the initiatives and going to get those and actually to fund whatever activities we are going through. So at the point in time, I, I sat back and, and wanted to, to give up, but then the words of my friend still um, is like um, a kind of haunt in my spirit, like this is not me. And I knew that millions and thousands out there, young people are drowning, not because they want to, but because society has already predicted their future, or because the family doesn't want to accept it, because it is actually what they believe that they are not gonna make a change. So I think that was the main reason why all, all over the challenges I, I went through, I was able, I was able to, to overcome and accomplish it. Five years time is a time of reflection. It's um, a goal that I've set to actually be the voice of the voiceless and allow all Sierra Leoneans comment on their stories. The thing is, I believe um, for far too long, young people don't have a voice and then it's the reason why especially they are drowning and if we can actually find a voice for them then I believe we can actually reach the point where we want to reach. So I envision myself in five years time that I'll have um, I'm the, one of the biggest media empires in Africa. I believe if I've come this far, I minor my minor and major my major. I know things that are of importance to me and things that I actually should prioritize. There is this um, saying, if you are to die today, will really you look back on your life and say, I wish I had or I'm glad I did. If your answer will be regret, what are you waiting for then? Stop complaining, don't say it's impossible. Life don't give you what you want, but what you are. Just like a mirror, that's what I believe in, like every morning, um, when I wake up in the morning, I go to the bathroom and look at myself in the mirror and I see me. And I know that I'm not going to see anybody else except me. So if you really want to see that change, it doesn't happen overnight. You need to step up and actually be that change that you want to see. So it's like life is a game. Play it hard and never believe in losing. It is your own game. It is your own story. Nobody can write your own story except you accept another man's 
um, like poetry or novel or whatsoever to be your own life but you are the writer of your own story you can change whatever thing you want to be you are better than who you think you are just believe in yourself and just do whatever you think can make you be the best version of you